pool ball incident. I mean, I, it, I was there, it was against our team, and uh, that that's something uh, I, I'll never forget. Uh, we're, we're still trying to get over it. Um, uh, just the fact that it was, it was, it was so, um, I mean, shocking. It's it just something that's really tragic, that's all I can say. And, uh, you know, those are the things you never want to experience on a baseball field. You never want to experience that. Uh, the other thing is, is also, you know, it hurts when, when, when uh, you lose a player like Nick Ahart. You know, he's another kid that I, that I managed for two years in Avon AA and a very promising future. And the next thing you know, you know, car accident passes away. But uh, those are the tragic ends, ends of it in, in baseball. And uh, you're hoping you never get to see that experience that. And I, I got to see it, and uh, it, uh, it hurts. But, but again, uh, that, that's... You know, it's part. That's mainly part of life, and uh, I just have to, to accept that those are the tragic ends of it that have gone through baseball. Uh, no one minor leagues is, uh, is. I think a lot of people don't understand, and, and they don't see. They see the finished product on the field. They don't know all the stuff that goes beyond behind the scenes, which they're the work that we do, the uh, uh, the work that the players put in, and also the living arrangements. I mean, you know, these players have to pay their own way, uh, get an apartment. You know, they're always. You know, they sign up for leases, and also they, as soon as the season, uh, or they get moved during the season, they got to take that lease out, get out of that, opt out for that, and go somewhere else. It's it's, it's really tough, especially on the married players that are married in the minor leagues. Uh, it's it's not a glamorous life by any means. It's a lot of time away from home. Uh, again, uh, I think that's why they call it the minor leagues. And, and uh, you know, when when they do get to the big leagues, it's it's definitely a great reward for them because of all the tough, uh, all the uh, time they put in and, and the effort and the struggles uh, that, 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 that they went through to get there. But it makes it all much, that much sweeter. But uh, the Myron Leagues, is, uh, it, it's, it's, it's tough, it's not easy, it's fun because we play baseball and we love to do this. But definitely in Myron Leagues, we don't do it for the money. Uh, we do it because we like the game of baseball. From a player standpoint, they do it because they want the rewards in the big leagues uh, in all aspects. Uh, and uh, for us coaches, we do it because we like to give back, we like to teach, and that's where it's for. It's not because of the money, because we don't make a lot of money, but it's definitely for, for these players. It's such a great feeling that you have when, when you get a player, and, and you know, because they're not the finished product in minor leagues, and you just see the progress that they make, that, that, that they put in the work, working with them one-on-one, -on -one, and you get really attached to these kids. Oh, I don't want to say kids, they're young men, to these young men. And, and once you see them in a couple of years that they get to the big leagues and they perform well and you see all the hard work you put in, it, it's the neatest, neatest thing. It, 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 it's, a sense of, it's a sense of pride and joy when you see that they hate, you know, they hey, grinded yeah, it out and they, they went through it and they finally got it. Uh, that to me is what it's all about, uh, you know, because, you know, they, they work their tails off. Again, you know, you see them in the minor leagues, you're like, you know, that they struggle, uh, but all of a sudden they get to the big leagues and you see all the hard work you put in that it's definitely a reward that we got to be a part of that to that to where they can have success and hopefully make a real good living.